introduce you to your new football coach as of 10 minutes ago, Coach John Gross. Uh, with the hiring of Coach Gross, I mean, it really brought a lot of excitement, cleared up some uncertainty that we all had as a unit. Um, it put us kind of back on track as far as our hard work and our dedication. And uh, I mean, as far as Coach Gross as a coach and as a man, like high character guy, you know, I really feel like he's qualified for the job. Uh, one thing I like about him is uh, he, at the end of every practice, we always break it down with a prayer, but we also hear a scripture from him, which kind of puts things back in perspective. Uh, also, something that he brought to the table, uh, I guess like, you know, with Coach Clark leaving, it's kind of the end of the good to great era, but you know, we start, we moved on to the DNA. And he was talking about uh, in, in, order for us, in order for us to win and be successful that, you know, we had to change our DNA and just kind of like reshape our mentality to more of a championship uh, caliber team. And it really just starts like in your DNA. It has to be something inside you. Baby, Coach Gross has been tremendous excitement for me, you know, and for this offense and as a team as a whole. Uh, as an offense, you know, we we broke all kinds of records in in just our first year. So the, having him back is just, like I said, tremendous excitement, and you know, we're excited to have him as a head coach. He's a great person, a great character guy, and you know, really loves his players. I would compare Gross to a Pete Carroll, you know, a real personable guy that you know gets everything out of his players that he can. Be the head coach. It's a, a big, uh, big deal for me. As we used the offensive coordinator last year, with him, having him as being the head coach, I know there's not going to be much of a uh, difference in the offense, offensive philosophy. So that's a that's a plus for me as an offensive lineman. I don't have to learn a new offense. Coach Gross is a person. He's a great guy. He's a great motivator. Uh, I love and enjoy playing for him on offense. We're going to do great things with him being the head coach. La, 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 la. before he creates an incredible environment of winning to be around. You want to be around this environment because of the person that he is. He believes in serving others and loving other people. He is a family man first. That key principle that he believes in is what's grounded here at Jacksonville State. And you know when you send your kids here, that is what they're going to be a part of. They're going to be a part of a family, a family that cares about each other, a family that loves each other, and a family that's looking out for each other because of those key principles that Coach Gross believes in. Just being here the past couple of days, you can see the excitement the players have for Coach Cross being named the head coach. You see them really buying in, working hard, and striving to win that national championship. Coach John Gross, well, where do I start? Um, Coach Gross is a man of faith, he's a man of family, he's a man who cares about his players. I'm gonna tell you, man, he was all about developing, you know, the total person, uh, and that means developing the football player athletically, academically, socially, and spiritually. And, I mean, he took a lot, a, a good coach takes his work home with him from time to time if need be. I'm waking up 
to ash and dust I wipe my brow and I sweat my rust I'm breathing in the chemicals yeah. I'm breaking in <laughs> The excitement comes gross uh, You know, being hired here, created for the guys Just keeping that continuity with him um, Becoming the head coach I think the guys are really excited uh, Especially last year He's, a, he's definitely a player's coach. He can relate to the players a lot. Um, and, the, and the kids really enjoy playing for him. Um, I enjoyed working under him last year. And you know him hiring me as a quarterback coach, I mean, I feel like it's an honor. He's working for such a great guy as in uh, Coach John Gross. Um, I think it's a blessing for him to be here. And um, I think it's definitely going to, you know, we're definitely going to continue the winning tradition here at Jackson State. Um, he's real big in his faith. And I think that's definitely going to trickle down to the players as they, you know, uh, get going with him and just get a better understanding of what Coach Gross wants from, from his players as well as the coaching staff. The energy he brings each and every day to work is real high energy, and I think the kids definitely uh, respond in a positive way. They're going to, you know, want to play even much, much more for Coach Gross with the energy he brings each and every day. Whenever Coach Gross enters the room, um, he pretty much lights the room up with his, with his smile and the energy he brings. Uh, when he walks in, the, the players sit up, um, and they're really attentive to Coach Gross just because they know how positive of an attitude he has each and every day. And I think personally, having been a former collegiate athlete, you'll definitely love to have a coach who enters the room with a positive energy. Life is ever changing. It never stays the same. You got stages of life. The older you get, the harder decisions are, are made. But you got to do what's best for your family. And I said, this value, just like it bond to that 2013 team, value the relationships you have with people on a daily basis. Because it is ever changing. Don't mean those relationships are going away. But you better appreciate them on a daily basis. And that's something we can all learn from this. And 